Hi friends, this is Susie, your gaming guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 1051 as a special dedication to Maria, who let me know that even though we used to have 50 moves on the level, we now only have 27 to remove the 37 jelly. That makes this at least a hard level, we can tell by the skull and the purple. I also have ticking time bombs set at 20. Hopefully I'll make a lot of damage along here and it won't be so drastic. And I'm probably going to use that frog here to help me. Now he's green, I want to match him with green, so if I can keep the rest of the green on the board for a while and use it once I've got this opened up, that would be best. This conveyor belt makes it so it's tough to put together specials. I was looking at all of those blue and thinking, wouldn't it be nice? But, no. Nah. Oh, look, these slide out. So that's important to know. Okay, so I've got things more open now. Uh, these guys are only single thick, but they're so far away. How in the world? I've got really fun things that I can't use at all. I'm going to take this out because I don't want the red to blow up. I want to hold on to it until it's in a spot where I can make better use of it. I could go ahead and start matching up that frog, but I'm going to take a stripe first and see if this still exists in a moment. Let's do this. And now this wrapped candy is in a good position. If I do this, I blow that up. But if I can do it while it's here, it could hit this and this. I don't think that's going to work, but I like that I'm at least figuring out this board a little bit better. Yeah, at least we got some of those. All right, but I really need to work on this frog, so I'm not going to make that stripe. I'm going to do this. I should have actually done it the other way. This is filled now, but I'm going to do this because I like wrapped candies along these edges. I could go ahead and take out purple, take out blue, or I could move this and then use this to fill the frog again, hopefully. That's what I'm going to try to do. I think I'm moving over here because this is so thick here. And now I can take out all purple and it's going to help over here as well. Now I've got this filled. If I could get a striped wrapped combo along the bottom here, they could take out this and this. Uh, I just don't seem to be able to do that. So let's do this right away. And now the frog is on the conveyor. So that's good. It'll be easier to get him going. I do have to worry about this top portion here. I don't quite know how to handle that. Oops, there goes everything. Maybe I should have looked before I did that. Now he's a wrapped candy, and this is wrapped, and it would take this out. It wouldn't get to this, but it would take this out. Should I do the wrapped wrap together? It'll probably also fill the frog again, so let's go ahead and do that. Not quite filled yet. I could do this, but then I'm using up the red, and I need red. I think I'm going to play around over here. Yeah, doesn't look like I'm going to get this done first time around, Maria, but I'm dedicated to keep going with this. Look at that. And I really feel like I've learned a lot so that my next attempt hopefully will be a little bit easier. Three jelly left. One, two, three. I'm actually surprised I got that far on the first try. I'll pause the recording, meet you back here with the new board, and see if I can be more effective, both with how I choose to use the frog and how I choose to use the specials. I made a few mistakes there that I don't want to repeat. See you in just a bit. Okay. Well, I could hit this, which is better than hitting the bottom portion, or this. Go this way. But I think I'm going to go ahead and go for the stripe. And another stripe. This is good. And let's just make a whole bunch of stripes here and hope that something wonderful happens because of this. Because I really do need wonderful things to happen. I saw that stripe too, but I decided to go for the one on the top. I need to try to get something set up with a wrapped candy right along the center. That would be fantastic if I can manage it. I don't have any good moves now. 
I think what I'm going to choose to do is take out this purple because I don't have much purple on the board. And by taking out things, I concentrate down the rest of the colors. Ah, I can't reach the purple now. I could take out a ticking time bomb. I could hit this. I think that's what I'm going to do. And that sets me up to try to fill this frog. I don't have a lot of green on the board. Oh, but hello. If I could wait. Things are a little too far away. Or if I could drop this onto the conveyor and then pair it up with this. This is what I'm doing. Okay, so I've already got part of this gone. I'm going to do this side now. And look at that. I got a color bomb and it took out a color. All right, so that's why I had more things disappear because that frog turned into a color bomb. Now I have to determine where the best place is to put this. I only have a few spots that still need to be gotten. This has the most right here. However, if I put it here, it gets stuck. So I'm going to take this and move it here. And actually there were three there and that was double thick. And now this is on the conveyor. So I'll have a much better shot at getting this to fill up again. That means I want to take out things that aren't red. I need red on the board so I can fill this. I also have that guy over there, which is not often easy to get to. So, oh, and that cleared out. And <laughs> look at this. Crazy stuff. Um, if I do this, that doesn't work very well. I need just a regular red. But now, if I could just take out blue, that would work, right? Oh, no, I've got this orange over here, too. I didn't see that one. I'm holding off. We've got crazy things happening here. So that's gone. I only need that. So now it would be a good time to match it with purple if I could do purple. I've got about 17 different ways to win this. Ugh. Here we go. I'm going to match it with green and that'll take that out. All right. Good thing I paid attention and didn't just immediately match it with purple. I noticed that that had changed. So that's how I beat this level, and I hope that it helps to see it being done. There are a lot of different things to look for, but you always have to examine where you can use those specials best. As always, thank you so much for watching, and Marie, I wish you the best of luck. Bye-bye.